In this video, we are going to graph a piecewise function. First off, what is a piecewise function? A piecewise function is just a function with two or more equations involved. So here in our example, we have g of x equaling 2x plus 2 if x is less than negative 6. g of x also equals x if x is greater than or equal to negative 6 but greater than or less than or equal to 2. And g of x equaling negative 3 if x is greater than 2. So we're going to graph each piece. I'm going to graph this first part with a uh, red. I'm going to use green for this middle one. And then I'm going to use blue for this other one. Okay, so if x is less than negative 6, it's going to be on the function 2x minus, uh, plus 2. So one way to determine this, you could draw that whole line of 2x plus 2, but then you're going to have to erase part of it because it wouldn't fit, that, fit the, the function because it has to be only valid for x less than negative 6. So one way of doing this is putting a negative 6 in for x, and that would give me 2 times negative 6, or yeah, 2 times negative 6 is negative 12. Negative 12 plus 2 is negative 10. So it can't be negative 6. So I'm going to put an open circle at negative 6 and negative 10, which would be right here. So I'm going to have an open circle. And then I'm going to use a slope, the slope of that line to come up with my other points. So that would be a slope of positive 2. So if I go down to 1, 2, to the left one, I would have a point right here. And this one's going to be going up from left to right. So I'm going to draw a line. It's going up from left to right through here. Now the green one, g of x, or think of my y, is going to equal my x if it's between negative 6 and 2. So that means it can equal negative 6 here. And it can equal a positive 2. So it has to be greater than, greater than or equal to negative 6, but less than or equal to 2. And if it's equal to x, that means the slope is 1. So that would be up 1 over 1, up 1 over 1. And I'm going to keep going until I get to a positive 2. I get, get rid of this. So that would go up 1 over 1. So then this one would be, draw my line here. And then the blue, it's going to equal negative 3 when x is greater than 2. So when it's greater than 2, so when x is greater than 2, going to be going to have an open circle at 2, negative 3, because it can't equal, can't equal 2. But anything bigger than that, it's always going to equal negative 3. So that means this is going to be a solid line going or a horizontal line going to the right. And that would be my piecewise function.